Hello everyone. <laughs> Man, I am so frustrated. I don't know if any of you seen, but CS Disco, ticker LAW Law, is over 52% down today. Just and the earnings report wasn't even that bad. I mean the company this company uh I'll read you all about that, but I mean, completely just over 52% down. But the reason why I'm frustrated is I had a buy order set in at um, like two hours ago, maybe like 1230 uh, at 1281 at $12.81 and it missed it. And, um, <laughs> and it just kept going up from there, going up, going up, little by little, going up, going up, going up. And then I had to finally buy in at 1380 and uh, and it, of course right when I bought in at 1380 that's right when it started going down 1370 <laughs> just but that's how it is that's how it is we it always happens to all of us but the reason why it's frustrating is because I looked at the chart and if I would have put my order in about three minutes earlier it would have filled at 1281 it would have filled if I would have just did it three minutes earlier. It was at, it went to like 1279 or something. Oh my God. Ugh. I'm just so frustrated about that. I'm just going to. All right. But anyway, let me read you what this company does. If you never heard of this company. CS Disco provides a cloud native artificial intelligence powered legal solution that simplifies e-discovery, legal document review, and case management for enterprises, law firms, legal services, providers, and governments. Our scalable, integrated solution enables legal departments to easily collect, process, and review enterprise data that is relevant or potentially relevant to legal matters. And let's read you the news that came out, why it's down over 52%. Let me just see where it's at right now. Oh, I'm up. It's at 1384. <laughs> nope. Just went down to 1376. I'm down. I knew it. All right, but anyway. <laughs> I could just sit here and cry on video, but I'm just going to read you the news. <sighs> Ready? This quarter marked another excellent period of accomplish accomplishments at Disco, said Kiwi Kamara. Cool name. Co-founder and CEO. We are excited to see a growing number of customers transitioning to our cloud-native solution as we increased our customer count to 1,000 255, an increase of 27% year over year. With the launch of topic clustering with automatic indexing, a highly anticipated innovation in our software, we continue to improve our full track solution to give our customers the necessary tools to transform the practice of law. Second quarter 2022 financial highlights. Total revenue was 33.7 million, up 14% compared to the second quarter of 2021. Adjusted EBITDA was 12.4 million compared to 1.6 million in the second quarter of 2021. A gap net loss was 20.2 million compared to 3.1 million in the second quarter of 2021. Recent business highlights, new offices. Disco officially opened the doors of its new headquarters in downtown Austin. Texas and a new office in New York, New York. Uh, Kiwi Kamara, co-founder and CEO, was named an Entre Entrepreneur of the Year 2022 Central South Award finalist. Trust Radius Top Rated Award. Disco received a 2022 Top Rated Award for Trust Radius with a TR score of 8.8 .8 out of 10. Third quarter and full year 2022 financial outlook. As of August 11th, 2022, 
DISCO is issuing the following outlook for the third quarter of 2022 and fiscal year 2022. Third quarter of 2022, revenue in the range of 32 to 34 million, representing a year-over-year growth between 7% and 14%. Adjusted EBITDA in the range of 19.5 to 17.5 million. Fiscal year 2022, revenue in the range of 132 million to 136 million, representing year-over-year growth between 15% and 19%. Adjusted EBITDA in the range of 60 to 56 million. DISCO's third quarter in fiscal year 2022 financial outlook is based on a number of assumptions that are subject to change and many of which are outside of our control. It actually results for. So, yeah. Let's see. I mean, they beat earnings in their past four quarters. Revenue, revenue is going up from 2019 to 40 million, from 2021 to 120 million. They got a lot of cash and no debt. I'll read it to you. They got. 238 million in cash and only $697,000 in debt. Mm. I mean, I'm not going to invest in this company. I mean, I just, I'm picking this up as a trade. But I mean, I saw, I saw it's down, you know, 50 plus percent <laughs> when the 52 week range was $69 at its high. I'm just so pissed I could have got it at 1281. But anyway, are you guys going to trade this? Because I don't know. Tell me what you guys are going to do. It's very tradable <laughs> right now. Pretty, pretty much oversold. So let me know what you guys are going to do in the comments. And I hope you have a lovely, blessed day. Goodbye.